Hey guys, F -f Fire here, bringing you another top five video. This time I'm doing up my top five ID and Xbox titles that released in 2023. Now this list is in no particular order, but it's highlighting f five of my f favorite ID and Xbox titles that released in 2023. Some of them I'm pretty f far in, others I still need to and want to put a lot more time into. But yeah, uh, first off though, l l let me know down below in the comments. Do you like the top five I'm going to have, or do you have a different top five? What, what, what are your top five ID and Xbox titles of 2023? Without further ado, we'll hop into my f f first game, P Planet of Lana. It's just a really f f fun, relaxing, calming puzzle game um, that I just had a lot of f fun with, and it was one of the more m memorable st stories that kind of st stuck with me. This game came out earlier in the year, but without f further ado, this is Planet of Lana. Oh. This is Planet of Lana. <laughs> I guess I kind of already ruined number two on the list, but uh, if you didn't already know what that little spurt of a clip was, hey, I'm trying, I'm new, new to a lot of this stuff, so I'm going to make mistakes and I'm not going to hide them. But uh, Party Animals is the, the second game that st stands out for me. You know, it's just, it's a f f f fun game where you can just be goofy and silly. Kind of gave me some f f f Fall Guys ragdoll kind of vibes which you know it was it was nice to have another game in that genre come out so without for further ado party animals Recreate Studio presents. Oh my god, this is so cute. Can you teach me how to play this game? Yeah. Ugh, wow. <laughs> yeah! Prepare your friends for a cute and relaxing Animal Crossing like experience, and then brutally destroy them all. Devs claim this game will improve your relationship with friends. Oh, brother, help me! Yeah, sure. Son of the Party Animals, an epic battle of the most epic animal characters, starring. Royal Corgi, Orange Cat, Canada Goose, Bullsh**, a regular duck that looks like absolutely no one. All of these animals have very fancy outfits. An actual Royal Corgi, an actual Orange Cat, an actual Canada Goose, an actual... This is Sparta! Let's interview the game producer. What inspired you to make so many outfits for these cute animals? Many! Oh, I made the same morning. Join the epic battle taking place in some of the most epic places. Don't try these in the human world. 
a submarine destroying the world, a freezing cold fighter jet, a f***ing black hole, football, trebuchet, huge hockey, exploding basketball. While the game offers various modes to encourage different styles of gameplay, but we all know that the only thing that's truly interesting is to watch. Now, I know a lot of you have who've supported me for a, a, a while and through the years will know that I'm kind of a sucker for just good stories, but also to different kind of experiences. And that's why the, th th the third game on my list that stands out is Stray, a perspective on a being a cat in a kind of narrative story that you kind of build yourself, but it's in this kind of dystopian future robotics civilization that's just a really fun and enjoyable experience. Now, m m most of you guys know I'm a pretty big f f f fan of sh shooter games. You'll probably see more sh shooter game r random videos on the ch channel periodically as f f filler than just about any other game, and I'm a pretty big Call of Duty fan. But when this game hit Xbox uh, a little later in the year, it's kind of still in beta, but still kind of available and you can play it. But for, for, for me, it's the, the finals. It's just a really the different take and experience of a sh sh shooter game and the d different classes and dynamics really st st stood out for me. And that's why the f f finals makes my top five list. Now, it wouldn't be a top five list of my favorite games in 2023 if it didn't have at least one simulation game in it. And for me, it's a game that the little bit of time I've gotten to experience with it definitely stood out to me just because it's more just r relaxing and kind of just allows me to uh, immerse myself into something different that I don't think I, I would ever do. And that's truck and logistics this is a simulator. For, for, for me, it's just, it's relaxing in the f f f fact that the game features, you know, a a online cross-platform multiplayer definitely is a, a big plus for me. So without further ado, here's my last of my top five.
ID and Xbox games for 2023. I'd love to know what your top five are down below in the comments. I know this is a different styles of videos that I'm trying out on the on the channel. I, I hope you're enjoying them. If you have any feedback for me, just definitely let me know. I know the editing quality and stuff like that. It'll improve over time, you, you know, so to do, doing my best on my own. Um, but yeah, I appreciate you guys' support. It's been an awesome year. Thanks for supporting me on this new, new channel. And I look forward to 2024 with you guys as well. Outside of that, I hope you have a wonderful New Year's and I will catch you next year.